Carter, uh, how would you kind of uh, rate your first experience playing with the racers and also how do you evaluate your performance? Um, it was amazing. Um, there was a lot of built up excitement. Um, you know, we got here June 1st and it's been a long time coming. Um, a lot of hard work and um, effort time has been put in to get up to this point and to finally, you know, get that first game um, off your chest in a sense. It was fun and it was exciting. I had a lot of fun um, playing in front of the crowd and yeah, I enjoyed it. What did Coach McMahon talk to you guys about in the locker room? Because they had cut that lead, I think at one point it was 17 in the first half, mm -hmm. down to 10. And then you guys came out and opened it up with a 15-5 run. What was yeah. kind of the conversation in the locker room and how did y'all play that on the court? Um, for us, he was just saying being locked in mentally. Um, we got ahead and we got a little complacent. We relaxed and they were able to hit some tough shots, um, kind of you know, cut into our lead a little bit. But um, in the second half, we wanted to focus on everyone just, you know, doing their assignment, um, guarding the ball one on one, being in our gaps, and just being solid um, defensively. Being out there on the floor and seeing KJ, a big guy that's going out there five for six from three point range, what is that like seeing from your perspective as a guard who likes to shoot threes too? Oh, it's fun. Uh, he spaces the floor and he's going to knock down that open shot. He's a hard worker. And if guys, you know, start to close out, he can put it on the floor as well. He's just a, he's a complete player and it's honestly, um, he makes it easier for us. He's a cheat code to have on the court. So it's fun playing with him. Carter, I, I know this has been so long ago and you've been with the team now and, and, and kind of worked your way in, but when they were trying to recruit you and bring you in, what was the message they were telling you as what your job would be? What was your job that they were trying to sell you on? Uh, to come to Murray State? Um, it was going to be um, basically I come in, um, I have a place where I can be a leader, um, I'll come in, lead these guys, um, be aggressive um, offensively, and yeah. You had three assists before you even took your first shot. Uh, is that, do you feel like that's a mature part of your game or just a comfort? Um, or were you just trying to look to distribute based on what the defense was giving you guys? Um, I wouldn't say I really try to look to do anything. I kind of just let the game, you know, come to me. Um, so we got, um, I think I had like a one more pass to Juice in the corner. He knocked that down, pushed the ball in transition. KJ was spotting up top of the key. So I just try to let the game come to me. Carter, at one point in that second half to me, it, it looked like everyone was just contributed. I mean, it was almost a feeding frenzy. Mm -hmm. Is there any what? Any way to describe how great that feels watching all you guys? Yeah, we. That well. Yeah, um, first of all, it's really fun to watch and be a part of. We've got a really competitive group. Um, we compete hard in practice. Um, practice is actually very competitive. So that's what you see when we're all on the same side of the ball. And when we get that energy going and, you know, guys are feeling good, and we got the energy cranked up, it can, you know, we can turn people over and get out and run. But then y'all had a little bit of a lull after that surge. So right. I imagine uh, mm -hmm. Coach McMahon was pretty uh, hard on y'all about yeah. that. Yeah, um, you know, it's just our responsibility to, you know, take the game one possession at a time, um, not try to hit home runs. And, yeah, we got to be locked in. That's on us. We got to be locked in every possession. Biggest thing you guys need to work on between now and Saturday? Um... I think just our mental toughness, um, playing, putting possessions together, um, and just being locked in defensively, knowing our assignments, because our team has a lot of potential on the defensive end of the ball. Um, and we want to be able to have, um, I know a couple times we got beat down the court um, in our press, um, but we want to be a team that, had, that you know, is able to use our defense to create our offense. You know, it makes the game a little bit easier. So, yeah, definitely be more locked in on the defense and on the ball. You guys just seemed to really, really quick all, all throughout the game, just the whole team. Uh, tell us a little bit about what that chemistry is like right now, just the, the team chemistry as a whole. Yeah, we got a real, first of all, off the court, um, we got a real tight group, um, tight group of guys, and that goes um, along with the coaching staff as well. We're all a big family here, 
So I think that just trickles down into the games and you can see how well we play together top to bottom of the roster. And um, we got, we're also unselfish as well and everyone eats and we just like to have fun and just go win.